Good at any time, my fuzzy aches, and welcome back to Batman Arkham Asylum. Let's see what you're. Uh... Do it! Do it! Do it! Do it! Do it! Do it! I did that without getting damaged as well. Whew. I must be getting better. Alright, last two. Allow selective detonation. Use for advanced takedown tactics. Upgrade and deal to automatically detonate with someone's threat detected. Temporarily incapacitate the target. Sure, that'll help me out in some of the other missions. Just to the end. Hey, you're all alone again, huh? Are you excited, Bats? I mean, we've been building up to this point all night. Don't tell me you've not been looking forward to it. I know I have. Surprise! <laughs> Everyone always said I should be in television. You don't want to miss this, really. It'll be a blast. Ten. Nine. Eight. Seven, six, five, four. Oh, jeez. Oh, no. Wow. That's not great. Mom. 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 Wait, why am I back here? I walked away. Like, was it Joker the whole time? And that's why it's moving? Maybe. Maybe a remote control thingy? Didn't you stop Batman? Uh, no. Me? It was your plan, you goofy clown. Go! <laughs> ah, I'm sending you back to the ventriloquist where you belong. Ah, oh, don't be mean. <laughs> You had to spoil everything, didn't you? Beating up Bane, feeding Scarecrow to Croc, slapping around Harley, my hobby by the way, and ruining all my lovely venom plants. It's over, Joker. Over? Why, my dear delusional Dark Knight, it hasn't even begun. <laughs> Okay. 
Does scum suffer mon money? Scum! Nicely done, Bats. You deserve a prize. <laughs> Your old pal, Commissioner Gordon. <laughs> Say, he looks all run down. Let's tap him up. No! <laughs> Batman! Get away! Ooh, here we go! We're gonna have some fun now, kiddies! You're trying to resist the change! That's not fair! <laughs> Come on, get in! <laughs> <laughs> so, you wanna play hardball, Bats? Do you? Your call! <laughs> pickle, pickle! No! Oh, you're ruining my big night! Months of planning down the crapper! I just wanted to bring down your grim facade and for once let you see the world as I see it. Giggling in a corner and bleeding. But you've denied me even that. I have nothing to live for. So <laughs> Now we get to the infamous part, infamous, infamous part of Batman Arkham. Arkham Asylum remains under lockdown, its staff at the mercy of the rampaging inmates. Just ten minutes ago, we received this taped message. Greetings, Gotham! Joker here! Arkham is mine! Now at least madness and told to the streets of Gotham. But first, direct your eyes to the roof. Circling the tower since this point. There, 
People say this is not the fight. They wanted the Joker. He's not a brute force type most of the time. He's more cunning. And apparently, there is concept art of him getting tightened up and becoming more like lanky and whatnot. Which I think would have more fit him, but also it, it's not what Titan does. Ready for this bat? And unfortunately for the series, ah! um, everything else that plays in the other game. games, night or city and night, come from me, art to this point where yeah, I'm bored of Joker takes the venom. Mind your head, bats! <laughs> I am the greatest! It would have been cool seeing more of a lanky Joker at this point. Who would uh, kind of skulk around an area and you had to silently go around trying to take him out, watching for guards and making sure he doesn't get you. I think that would be cool. If that's what they were going to do. <laughs> oh, stealth off between the two of them. When I'm done here, I will march on. But like I said, like this is what Titan does to the individual that takes it, buffs them up, and makes them a beefy boy. You die for this, bats! Man. Especially considering the other fights we've had that have been really inspired. You lose, like, and everyone He attacked me three or four times here, jumps up there, sends goons after me, and then I just pull him down and punch him. It's just... Come in, yeah, boys. there should have been him more. Out of it. I've got a city to it. Here it comes. <laughs> <laughs> Dare go after that gun. Woo! <laughs> 
Big Bang. Dad, thank God. I was so worried. I'm fine, Barbara. The GCPD Bigger finally has control of the asylum. Doctors are treating the injured, but it looks like it'll take some time. All super criminals are back in custody. <laughs> Quite a mess in there. And the venom-enhanced inmates are returning to normal. Though for some, the process can be quite painful. Dad, how are you doing? I'll survive. See you tonight, Barbara. Shame about your car. Can I give you a ride? Thanks, Jim, but I have one on the way. Get some rest. You deserve it. Stay safe, Jim. Asylum. Hey, lovely game. Love the game so so much. Now the only thing I want to do after this is just go through the uh, get all the collectibles. So we'll do this. But thank you, my fuzzies, for watching Batman: Ark of Asylum. Let me play our Batman: Ark of Asylum. A lovely game. A lovely series that I really like. It's one of my top series. I love coming back to it. I love playing it. Just enjoying it. The story is grand. The characters are interesting as always. Ending boss fight could have been different. But... And as always, thanks everyone who created this game for me to play and everyone else to play. It's just a treat. It hits all the right notes. It literally spawned to good good sequels in the third one that was still pretty good but I don't know like I said I'm replaying Origins so I'll see how I feel about it I never had a problem with Origins and it's, it's sad because it set up some things for a future game that never came to be I believe maybe oh maybe they'll come go back to it and I would like a remake of it at least to get all the DLC together but yeah, good game. Thanks everyone for work who worked on the game for making such an amazing project. And it just gets better from here. Oh yeah, going all the way back to Killer Croc. Was he just able to leave the place at anytime he wanted like it, it felt like that because he just came up and kind of destroyed uh whoever uh scare not whoever scarecrow the great and almighty scarecrow uh, it's sad for him to go but yeah Cute little fellow.
So yeah, maybe sometime in the future I'll come back and do more of the challenge matches. Because uh, there's quite a few of those, quite a lot of those. Yeah, I definitely want to get done all, get collect all the collectibles uh, before I put a wrap on the Arkham game. Yeah, definitely good. Worth checking out and checking out the other games that followed. Always good. Always fresh. different voice actor for Batman and Bruce Wayne? Oh, no. No, they do not. Italian cast list. Scarecrow. Spanish cast list. Scarecrow. French cast list. Scarecrow. Germany. German cast list. Scarecrow. Mm. Game's a treat, as I've said before. Really worth playing it through, all of them through, and getting as much out of it as you want. Flash can. Uh. Oh, let's see. Let's see what... Arkham. Oh, my bad. My apologies for skipping that. Guess some Titans escaping. That's awesome. I'm so glad we got Scarecrow. Ah, uh, congratulations! You unlocked the armored Batsuit to use in challenge mode. Joker. Bend the armor going as quick as possible. There ain't that many challenges. Challenges for Joker. Nah. Extra content. Highest score. What goes up? How long can you survive the world without taking a single blow? Neat. All right, well, we're going to go right back into it. XP, gain XP to get, regain health and upgrade to the latest wine technolo technology. Yes. Do, do, do. Yeah, I'm right by it. Let's start with the penitentiary. This is the penitentiary, right? I believe it is. Surprise cat. Mm, I didn't get the one thing yet. Mans there to try and stop me. But he can try. But I'm Batman. They'll stop him. Alright. Battery 
it didn't work, but that will. That'll work just fine. Fine, just fine. Open. Open it. Thank you. You love me out greatly. You know, I should have left this. I should have left this for last. Spooky in here, you know. Yeah. I mean, I'm I'm not scared walking around this place. I'm the railing, I guess. No fear, no fear, no fear! Hello, Harley. <laughs> yeah, I feel bad for her. She goes through so much crap from the Joker. I'm glad that in now uh, newer series are coming out. The Harley Quinn show in comics and whatnot, where she's more of a going on her own. I don't like her as a character. It's just Joker's an a-hole. Always has been. All right, I'm sure there's nothing else over here. So when I get the map and look at it, I won't be coming back. That also would be giving me the prompt of the riddle. All right, so far so good. Whooped, whooped. place is gonna really need to remodel everything. I took a walk around my island. I passed by the penitentiary and felt nauseous at the thought of the filth it contained. I looked out over the Gotham Bay and in the distance I saw lights. No doubt boats bringing more filthy degenerates to my city. I swore again to protect her from this darkness. Mm. Wanting to do good is good. We should all try and do good. But it's when you want to cause havoc or affect other people's lives. Then it doesn't turn out so well. I love how he just does not talk, he just 
all he has is laughter. Laughter, that's all. He knows it doesn't matter. Don't worry about me. It's all over. Joker's about to be taken out. But I'm gonna look around, stop Riddler first. In this continuity. Yes. Liberate me ex infamous. In the main cell block. Yes, it is a cell block that is main. Bet you didn't know that, did you? Not many people do. Oh. It's gotta be up here. Wait, no, I do own the map. I just cleared everything. Oh, come on. If I knew that, I wouldn't have... Man! Do I actually flip and flap and looked around? I don't know what else we could do. Lead nice, peaceful lives. At least not all the guards have been killed off. Just a lot of them, unfortunately. More walls! I argued with the latest group of young, eager doctors. They bored me with theories and ideas, proving that they had no theories on how to cure these animals. Only one shared my vision. I offered her the chance to explore her dreams. She accepted. We'll make a good team. Forgotten about this one. Dang, do I have to be on the other side of the room just in order to be? Talking, Nigma. Fed up waiting for me to finish your puzzle. <laughs> and finish them, I will.
do I get up there? There's a vent. And where there's a vent, there's another vent. there on the bed, huh? Let's have something in the background at least. Never found all the pieces. Yeah, apparently. 
he hid the bodies in the sewers after some time. I don't I don't wanna think about it. The Gotham police dragged a new patient to the island. They said he was responsible for the disappearance of hundreds of the city's vagrants. As I looked at his disgusting body, all scales and teeth, my mind ran free, dreaming of delicious punishments to break this monster. Doctors gathered around, poking it, examining. But only I knew what would cure him, once and for all. Well, ain't that fascinating? Not you. Don't be. He was right. 
And yet he gets mad at me for supposedly cheating. That's how we do. was too strong. His animal savagery nearly cost me my life. I took my frustrations out on a lone patient. His case notes suggested he was a paranoid schizophrenic. His pleas as I beat him to death suggested much more. His confessions what illuminated him. My path was clear. Mm. What a dangerous world. You subscribe to? Uh, let's see. You I still need more from. Script patient evaluation one. Patient name is Victor Zaz, diagnosed clinically insane after the murder of at least 20 women in the Gotham area. Hello, Victor. I'm Dr. Cassidy. Seeing as this is our first session, let's spend some time getting to know each other. I don't need to know you, Miss Cassidy. Everything is fine. Don't you think that's a very negative outlook on life, Victor? You no doubt read my file. Yes. Yes, I have. It says you come from a wealthy family, that your parents died, and how you lost all the money gambling. And none of it matters. Why do you keep saying that, Victor? Because the only thing that does matter is the mark. Have you seen my work, Miss Cassidy? If you're referring to the marks on your... Of course I mean my talent mark. And I know the space for the mark. Do you want to see a Creepy. Let's discuss your obsession. 
obsession with Batman. Hardly an obsession, Miss Young. I simply feel an obligation to expose him. You know who he is? More important, I know what he is. What do you mean? It's obvious. The mask, the weapons, the scare tactics. He's a criminal. No different than Joker or Two-Face. Or myself. Most people consider him a hero. Most oh, people are idiots. They can't see Batman for the villain he is. Riddle me this. How did he get his car and his gadgets? With money stolen from the criminals he defeats. Why does Gordon turn a blind eye to his antics? Batman bribes him. The answers are right in front of your stupid gawking face. Edward, please, calm down. Wake up, Gotham! <laughs> no sane, law-abiding man does those things. No one's that selfless. Batman is as vile as they come. Security! Security! Calm down, Enigma. Probably a good thing they got away, whoever they were. Victor has been more subdued recently. Response to medication has been poor. Gotcha. Hello, Victor. Gotcha. Is there anything you'd like to talk about today? Victor! This is going nowhere. Gotcha. Guard! Gotcha. Get him out of here! You heard the doctor. Get out. Gotcha. Didn't you hear me? He's got a knife! Ah! Get a trike in him! Get a trike in him! Oh god! He's on Bill! Oh no! This is my final interview with Edward. I have gone as far as I can. I can no longer tolerate his mood swings and tantrums. I have more important work to be getting on with. He will be transferred to Dr. Whistler's care in the next week. Good morning, Doctor. How are you today? Fine, thank you, Edward. You're in a good mood. I'm always in rare spirits when I'm about to be released. Edward, you know you don't come up for parole for another three years. First thing I'll do is have dinner at that Italian place on 19th Street. Seriously, Edward. I only hope Joker has completely trashed the city. Oh well, I'm sure I'll find out soon enough. Wait, have you been in contact with the Joker? He escaped Arkham weeks ago. And yet, one hears things. What thing? Oh, something about a surprise party for Batman. I forget the rest. You know Joker. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Edward, if you know anything you're talking about, lies to be in sync. What did Joker say? You forget, Doctor. I'm the one who asks the riddles. I love these. Listening to these, uh, interviews. Giving you a little bit insight into their mind going forward. As well as also some timbits of, oh, it was actually said and planned about the Joker way, ad way in or a little bit in advance for it. Victor has been in isolation since the attack on Zagar last week. As I wait for him to be brought up to me, I have had time to review his notes. I am increasingly worried he cannot be cured. He has no empathy for his victims. Deep down, I believe he views all of us as potential victims. Doc, are you okay? What's happening? Meet Saz. He broke out of isolation. He's gone. Oh, God! Don't worry, Doc. You're in the safest place. He's definitely left the island. Of course. But someone needs to alert the authorities. He'll need to kill again. Do you understand me? Needs to. Oh, no. He's gone after Dr. Cassidy. Sarah, it's Gretchen. Listen to me. Sarah, do not answer the door. Can you hear me? Do not 
Was it Zaz though? We may never know. Patient interview. Pamela Lillian Isley, November 12th, 11.33 a.m. Good morning, Pamela. How are you today? Fun. Today is a special day. What do you mean? This is the anniversary of my new life. When I found my true self. My destiny. Are you referring to the event with Dr. Woodrow? Yes. What else? Of course, at the time, I thought Jason had poisoned me. But in retrospect, he did me a huge favor. And why do you believe what he did has helped you? He showed me the bigger world. A world I should protect. Of course, my first offer was rejected. Offer? You tried to kill everyone in Gotham. Well, sometimes you need to prove that hard in order to make something flourish. Not wrong about pruning, but considering it's a whole people and society, that's kind of true. Next interview, Pamela Lillian Isley, November 14th, 10 to 21 a.m. Hello, Pamela. Hey, I'd like to go back to something you said in our last conversation. Ask me anything you like. You said your first offer to help Gotham was rejected. How could you possibly believe that? What do you mean? You released thousands of poisonous spores to Gotham. I'm not interested in bodies, Doctor. Horrible fleshy sacks walking around destroying my poor babies with their greed and arrogance. But aren't you one of those fleshy sacks? You're a... were a doctor too. How can you turn your back on us? Quite easily if it happens. But not these two. You're different. I feel we have a connection. Really? You do? Of course. Hmm, that's a good sign. Patient interview, Pamela Lillian Isley, November 14th, 10, 21 a.m. Hello, Pamela. Today I'd like to go back to something you said in our last conversation. Actually, You said your first offer to help Gotham was rejected. Poor, poor Ben. Oh, I barely heard you from him. Patient interview one. Patient would refer to me after the incident with Dr. Murphy. The interview was up to break down the case. I believe it was brought about after the loss of his wife and child. As yet, the patient has been unable to speak. Continued observation shows little mental activity. It's as if the shock of what he saw triggered his mental collapse. There's someone in here! Super criminal. I warn you right now, 
These are hardcore psychotics. Most would rather kill you than speak to you. I'm sure I'll be fine, Doctor. They'll eat you for breakfast. I mean it. One or two of them will enjoy it, too. Be careful. Alright. Patient interview number one. So I'm your first, all right, Tops? You know what they say. You never forget your first time. I'll try to make it memorable for you. Oh, you already have. Tell me, why do you do the things you do? <sighs> why do you think I do? You gave me a map. The map shows me where the X's are. Well, the question marks are. Question marks mark the spot. To pick that up. Every day I found the patients more distracting. Their insane mutterings and constant twitching disgusted me. There was only one way to cure this evil. Only one way to purify the city and ensure its future. I needed to prepare myself. I needed to be ready. Great. Our low security wings offer normal but troubled individuals a safe haven for recovery. An extensive All right. get to the next area and then I'll have to call it good times good times good times my friends <laughs> it's good shouldn't be much longer Oh, almost fell in there. That would be embarrassing. Through the tree. Nope. Ba da bum bum. Ba ba da bum bum. Up, we'll be into the botanical gardens. We'll see what the results of uh, Ivy has left in this place since she passed on. Major rest in peace. Whew. 
<laughs> yes, indeed. All right. Well, thank you, my fuzzy knights, for watching this stream. Having a lot of fun with it. Beat the game. Just gonna get the collectibles and have fun. I love this game so much. It's great. Glad you could join me for it. So yeah, like I said, next time I play, it'll be going after the last of the collectibles. Oh yes. It will be fun. Either way, thank you my fuzzy eyes for watching, and have a good anytime. Take care. <laughs>